Hello everyone, this is InformalGadget.com and today we're going to talk about a little feature that Macintosh computers have and it's if you're running Lion or Mountain Lion you'll see that if you mouse over an icon from a video file you'll get this play button and you could actually click on the play button and you could preview the file or the video without having to open the actual video and I'll just show you right here with this one you press play Hello everyone, this is in, in the video starts and you can actually see the video inside the little icon without having to open it. Well, I received an interesting question from Robbie Zbot and he wanted to know how we could disable the preview but keep the icon so that he could know what, what video it is without having to read it on the side. Now he showed me the way he knows how to do it and which wasn't working for him where you right click on the video or the icon and you go down to show view options and then down here on the bottom you'll see that it says show icon preview if you uncheck that it'll take the whole preview away it'll take the icon and the the play button the uh, the preview play button so that's not what he wants he wants to still keep the icon the picture of the video but he doesn't want the play button to pop up every single time he mouses over so I did figure out a way to get the icon on your video uh, previews, but not have the, the preview playback uh, play there. And the way you do it is you make sure that you have show icon preview checked so you could see the image. And then all you have to do is go here to icon size and lower it to 60 by 60. Once you lower it to 60 by 60, the playback goes away. So anything lower than the 60 by 60, the playback will go away, and anything higher than 60 by 60, the playback will come back. So you just lower it to 60 by 60, and you're all good. Now, I didn't find an option anywhere in the settings or anywhere else where you could choose if you wanted the preview on or off, and this is the closest I got to it by just lowering your icon size a little bit. If anybody else finds any other way of doing it, go ahead and feel free to leave your comments down below. And hopefully that helped you out, uh, Robbie Zbot. Thank you for the question. And if anybody needs uh, any help or anybody else has a question and they want me to show them how to do something, if I have the means of doing it, I'll be glad to, to help you guys out. If this video helped you out, give me a thumbs up down below. Go ahead and leave any questions, comments, concerns in the comment section. And don't forget to visit InformalGadget.com.